Hello everybody, this is Triggy J. And this is RTXD. And before we go on to the main topic of the video, I just want to give a great big shout out to Broketail, who uh, traded me this strange degreaser with a couple of strange parts attached, attached allies extinguished, and projectiles reflected. And I promise I will always pride myself on having more um, counts on my strange parts than on my kills with this thing, because that's what being a pyro is all about. Anyway, the main topic of the video that we're going to talk about is the thing I'm holding in my hands right now, the Scorch Shot, which is the new flare gun for the Pyro, the only weapon that the Pyro received in the Pyromania update, and it's pretty rubbish. I'm just going to say it straight out. We do like about the weapon. We we'll tell you why we don't like it and why we do like it. it is, Shall we start uh, with why the reasons we the reasons we like it then? Um, I think that was that was Scorch Shot just hitting me right there. Um, the reasons we like it. We like it because, firstly, the thing that I always seem to like about Team Fortress 2 weapons, I rarely ever find myself not liking this about Team Fortress 2 weapons, is the way it sounds, and the way it looks, the way that the way the projectile looks. It looks great, sounds great, and I, I really have a lot of fun with that. I mean, the, the sound was one of those things that makes me want to use the weapon more, and that is important, and the sound is pretty cool. So The other thing we like about this weapon is that uh, it has a blast radius, so it will set people on fire in a certain radius around where the shot hits. Exactly. One of the cool things you could do with this weapon is burn everyone on the point with the scorch shot because of the blast radius, and just get out your extinguisher and use those crits against them. Go crazy. So yeah, those are the cool things, but the, the reason I don't like this weapon at all, and the, the, the reason that I think this weapon is not not fabulous, Another sentry there. Those sentries were really annoying me last round, and I think there's an engineer coming up with another one. I'm oh dealing with them now. The yeah, there are two sentries already. Anyway, we will um, try and continue. We'll try and continue, despite the uh, sentry madness that is going on right now. Anyway, um, things we don't like about this weapon. 50% damage penalty. When you hit someone with this thing, you're only going to do, I think it's about 15 damage, something like that. That's really not great. Even with crits, this thing is not not fabulous. So um, that's that's not great. The other thing is um, the main the main benefit of this weapon is that it knocks people back. And I find that even even when you hit someone, it doesn't always knock them back very far. And quite often, you'd be better off if you want to keep someone away from you with knockback. You'd be better off just using your air blast. But um, the, yes, so I, I just don't see the benefit of this weapon. I'd always rather be using the flare gun or even the detonator over this weapon. Because they are just much more much more versatile, I'm going to say, and you you can get crits with those things. I thought you said you were dealing with those sentries. Yeah, well, all the pyros and heavies are getting to me. Get your direct hit out, dude. What are you playing? Thanks, soldier. Got your direct hit Actually, on? I don't have a direct hit. I was using it all to get the bazooka. Dude, not cool. I know, right? I know, I know. Anyway, um, I think we're gonna stop it here. We're gonna wait until um, we're gonna wait until we talk. We've talked about the scorch shot enough. We're gonna wait until the um, sentry craziness that is going on down there has stopped before we resume talking. All right, then. If you have not seen Meet the Pyro, please look away now. All right. So these are the other new weapons-ish that the Pyro got in the update. They're not really new weapons, but they are reskins of old weapons. And what is going on on my screen right now is called Pyrovision. Now any class can go into Pyrovision at any time because we've all been given a pair of Pyrovision goggles, vintage Pyrovision goggles, to use at our convenience. And uh, it basically it just makes take, it takes funny. us into the Pyro's world you can also get a pair of Pyrovision goggles if you miss the deadline by dominating a person who's wearing them. Now, what I'm using at the moment is the weapon that Pyro uses in the video, the rain blower, which fires rainbows instead of fire. That's pretty if awesome. You're on I've Pyro also Land. got. People who are not in Pyroland won't see this actually. That's true, but equipping it takes you into Pyroman Pyroland automatically. You don't need any goggles for that. Um, yep. Basically, Pyroman just man just makes everything look super trippy. And uh, things things go on like um, you will become best friends with people instead of dominating them, 
and uh, I think that's a quite funny. Actually. That's I quite, like that. it's quite funny. Like, look, I'm best friends with someone. Cake that's, that's, instead that of that makes me look happy. That makes me feel happy. This this cake inside. instead of health packs, um, things like that, and I it's 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 just a little fun feature that Team Fortress 2 has. Team Fortress 2 is a game like that where things just they just have a little bit of fun with it, and I really exactly. I really I really like that. I really enjoy that. So I'm having fun with my with my strange rain blower, running around firing rainbows at people, using the scotch. If you shot. saw if you saw the previous videos, uh, one of the previous videos we made, I have a strange lollipop which uh, is actually quite fun to use. So, all right, uh, we've come to the end of the round, and that's the end of the gameplay. This has been um, an honest gameplay. This is this is what this is what is going on uh, as we're trying to talk and play at the same time, and. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope to see you next time. Uh, please, we'd love some feedback, so comment, like, tell us what you think about the new weapons, and we hope to see and you next time. And obviously our videos, we want to know what you think. So, we really hope to see you next time. This is Triggy J, signing out. This is RT, out.